Well now, if it isn't two of my dearest friends. As for the other two, I don't believe we've had the pleasure. Not in this vessel, perhaps. Tis I, Vashan. Though, you are welcome to call me Vritra, if you prefer. Pay me no mind. I merely accompany them. I pray you forgive us our intrusion. If you are occupied, we shall call again anon. It's quite all right. We've just finished swapping all our secrets anyway. Erinville occasionally comes and shares the latest Gleaner gossip, you see. From forgotten ruins to mysterious relics, if there's aught that might be of interest to the students, he kindly lets us know. Alas, I must soon depart on an expedition. As I may be away for an extended period, I wish to give Kryle fair warning. Hence my visit today. I see. There are specimens that want for procuring, I presume? No, no. It isn't guildship business, but rather... A uh, homecoming. But enough about me. You have business too, yes? And I'm in the way. Far from it. As a matter of fact, we should be grateful if you could stay and share your knowledge of the nearby isles with us. We seek a means to travel to the void. There, a man named Golbez plots to invade our world. A man who even now holds my sister hostage. To that end, we require a great quantity of ether, which we understand may be had on the Isle of Harm. We came in the hope of exploring how it might best be procured. An invasion from the 13th? Must the stakes always be so dramatic? You have a knack for finding trouble. If cleaners collected world-ending crises, you could make quite a name for yourself in our profession. It's true the Isle of Ham is a veritable font of ether. But, as it's under the Forum's direct jurisdiction, only a privileged few get to set foot there. I myself haven't. So if we want to help ourselves to the Isle's ether, we'll need to secure the Forum's permission. Very well. The students of Baldessian recognize your endeavors as combating a grave threat to the world. As representative, I hereby pledge our full assistance. Now that it's official, you may leave the politics and paperwork to me. Our operations remain small, but we shouldn't meet any undue resistance. We are truly grateful. If I may. According to the original plan for the Exodus, Ether collected from the Isle of Harm was to power the Ark. Art thou perchance familiar with the logistics of this endeavor?
Uh, I don't know anything about that, I'm afraid. Nor do I think any cleaner would. You might have better luck asking someone involved with the Ark's construction. Margaret, for instance. She's a researcher in Charlene Hamlet. I met with her for a job recently, and she mentioned working on the Ragnarok's propulsion system. You could do worse than to seek her out while awaiting the forum's verdict. We may well do just that. Our gratitude for thine advice, and may this threat be but a memory upon thy return. You're quite welcome. Now then, if you'll excuse me. I best start drafting our petition. Go on and find your researcher. I'll contact you as soon as we've made progress. Let us leave matters here to Mistress Kryle and hie ourselves to Labyrinthos. Right then, time to put our best foot forward. Oh, a pity you can't tidy yourself. I should have had Ishtola enchant you when I had the chance. And what have we here? Later, Kryl. Later. You've work to do.
Bound for the Isle of Harm. You look like the ones Master Fortuno told me to expect. If you're ready to depart, then so am I. Just say the word. Is something the matter? I did recruit one other to our party, but he is late to arrive. Forgive me my delay. Thankred? Tis good to see you. If it isn't Varshan, they do grow up so quickly. Urianje tells me we have a host of exciting new tribulations to face. And you must be Zero. I've heard all about your daring do in Garlemald. A pleasure. Apart from strengthening our company with his redoubtable skill at arms, Sankred may also serve as a mentor in those matters that trouble thee. I speak of the intangible forces which bring souls together. Thancred is possessed of experience both unique and insightful that I am sure he would gladly share with thee. Thou needst but ask. <laughs> 